this is all they had. Listen. How do you do it? How do I do what? Forget. How do you wash away the things that you've done? You don't. You just learn to live with it. So the moment of truth between us. New York or Paris? No, 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 no! Oh, shit. Come on, we gotta find a way to make this thing go faster. Like? I don't know. Help me find it. That's not it. Certainly is. 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 Try again. Hold right. on. Here you are. Booker! We've got to stop them! No, that's the E. No, Booker, that's hurry! Certainly it. No, it's not. Here. Is. Isn't. Is. Isn't. Is. Try again. No, you try. Fine. Stop it! Fine. Stop it! You don't Here know what are. you're doing! Huh. There it is. You've done it now. He's, he's coming back. He's coming back. The notes were correct. The instrument was not. One needs both to get his attention. But if you know how to sing to him... He will take you where you need to go. Who are you? We are where we are needed. And needed where we are. So Comstock uses these songs. Are there others we can use? Something to keep the bird off our back? Perhaps you should ask the maestro himself. So where is he? Of course. Well, at least they left the piano. Booker. That's Comstock House. If we're gonna find him, we should start there. The box are coming! We need to leave the dock! We need to push off immediately! The box are coming! Where are these people going? Wherever the box pockets are. You can do it! Come on, you can do it! Just jump! Jump! Honey, I can't do it! I cannot do it! I'm sorry! You need to remove your belongings or we can't take any more people! The barge is full! You're going to have to remove some of your luggage if we're going to fit more people on deck!
Elizabeth. Hi. Locked. Elizabeth. That won't take but a minute. What is it about that song that brings in the bird? my warden. He's just Comstock's pet, isn't he? Just like me. There. Look at this. Fitzroy's no better than Comstock. Was she? Uh, once people get their blood up, it ain't easy to settle it down again. This is on our hands, isn't it? Here's some cash. Okay, catch. I don't think anyone can really see the future, do you? I, I saw something once when I first got here. A dream. It was New York, larger than any New York I ever saw. It was burning. Hmm. One of the prophets of magic is rubbing off on you. What are you doing? <laughs> yeah! Who are. 
They, well, at least she, invented the technology that allows the city to float. Giant balloons. Quantum particles, suspended in space-time at a fixed height. So, not giant balloons? But the thing is, my book said they disappeared several years ago. I told you they'd come. No, you didn't. Right. I was going to tell you they'd come. But you didn't. But I don't. Are you sure that's right? Something tells me they're not exactly what they appear. I was going to have told you they'd come? No. The subjunctive? That's not the subjunctive. I don't think the syntax has been invented yet. It would have had to have been. Had to have had been. That can't be right. They seem to want to help. They seem to be out of their minds. Odd, isn't it? What's odd? The fact that we sometimes... Finish each other's sentences. Exactly. It would be odder if we didn't. <laughs> How do you suppose they manage that? I'll get back to you after I figure out the floating city bit. Come on, Comstock House is up ahead. The seed of the prophet shall set the throne. He was grooming me, wasn't he? Comstock? Yeah, I think so. Then why lock me up? Well, I'm guessing you didn't want to be groomed. Maybe you had something in the works to make you agree. Like what? I think it's best we don't find out. <laughs> Thought they'd stay on top forever. <laughs> Got a lot here. I could mm. ever so use your aid. I I hope no one has forgotten. It's done. Stop. When we next meet, it won't be to parley. See, I went out to that hall of heroes to scalp your false shepherd for you. Turns out, though, DeWitt speaks Sue. He helped me to swap words with this crippled child I've been uh, looking after. Now, after hearing how the kid has fared in your city, I'm thinking when we take your pelt. I'll let him hold the knife.
Could you take a look at this lock? That won't take but a minute. All yours. Need money? Take this. That'll do. Here you go, you sons of bitches! You We shall not be silenced! <laughs> Much obliged. Fancy putting those lock picking skills to work? On it. Done. Kill the pig! Okay, like hell! Dips on his boots. Dips on the girl! Those turnstiles are one way. Should we check out the bookstore before we leave? Got a lock. Looks easy enough. Got it. Stock failed to understand is that our contraption is a window not into prophecy but probability. But his money means the Lutes field could become the Lutes tear, a window between worlds, a window through which you and I might finally be together. I 
shooting up the place and took my girl got her locked up in the salty oyster his hidden closet he keeps all his treasures just need to hit the button under the register to open it but Lock. My book said most fools keep the combination no more than 20 feet away. Let's hope we find one of those fools. so keen on lock picking and code breaking if you put a person in a cage they develop an interest in such things i suppose so and i won't be locked up again Elizabeth. Elizabeth, you promise me. I will stop him. No. That is an oath you cannot keep. But promise me that if it comes to it, you will not let him take me back.
snuck in while the Vox was shooting up the place Look. and don't Vox are tearing this place apart. Salty oyster. His hidden closet. He keeps all his treasures. Just need to hit the button for the register.
Elizabeth, back there at the shop, what you asked me to do... Let's not discuss it. No, but what did that thing do to you? If you were to take me back, that's death, Mr. DeWitt. There's something so like it, I cannot tell the difference. On to this? In front of all the men, the sergeant looked at me and said, Your family tree shelters a teepee or two, doesn't it, son? 
this lie, this calumny, it followed me all my life. From that day, no man truly called me comrade. It was only when I burnt the teepees with the squaws inside that they take me as one of their own. Only blood can redeem blood. Thinking about that dream that you had, New York on fire. There's something about it. Mm. Beyond that gate lies Comstock. Comstock, how lovely to see you. Wonderful of you to make the journey, especially considering your painful death 19 years ago. Lady Comstock. The dress. The thing has mistaken me for my mother. Your fingerprints do not seem to be your own today, Lady Comstock. Are you unwell? This isn't going to work. I think it can. Your mother's dead, Elizabeth. Yes. I think it's time I paid my respects. Let's head to where she's buried. Elizabeth? Looks easy enough. All done. There's the graveyard. My mother's grave. Where are you going? Come on. What are we looking for? abandons their child doesn't draw a lot of sympathy in my book. Take a moment to think about what you're doing. There. Will you open the door or do I have to go in with her? Elizabeth, are you all right? No, 
Where, where did she go? Hold on, you need to rest for a minute. No, I'm getting that hand. Elizabeth, why is your mother a ghost? She's not. He, he used me to, to power that device. He opened up some kind of tear. Perceive time as it truly was. What reason would grammar professors have to get out of bed? Like us all, Lady Comstock exists across time. She is both alive and dead. She perceives being both. She finds this condition disagreeable. Perception without comprehension is a dangerous combination. Look! Footsteps. She goes to unfinished business. We have to follow her. Convince her to open the gate to Comstock House. She doesn't seem all that cooperative. There is a way to bring her to reason. Three truths you must discover first. Truths which, in this world, Comstock has destroyed. If only one of you had the power to alter time and space. That would be a blessing, wouldn't it? Hmm. They're sarcastic. There's something off about Lady Comstock. Yeah, I noticed. No, you don't understand, she. She doesn't belong here. I brought something to her. I'm just... I'm not so sure it was her.
Do 